All right, what is going on guys? It is Benny and today we're gonna to be doing a grand challenge going for 12 wins using classic mortar. Now, honestly, I really enjoy using this deck in grand challenges. I feel like it matches up very well in grand challenges with all the different decks you might face. This guy's gonna miss the mortar kite right off the start. So we are off to a good start. I am happy with this. Now, a couple different ways you can play this deck. I'm gonna show you guys like some of the tornado tricks that I like to do because those are the most fun to do. He will get a little bit of little prince damage, but that's okay. Um, Let's just wait now and see what he does. I think I'm going to go for a mortar, but yeah, let's go. <laughs> let's go for a mortar. Let's be reckless. But anyways, guys, I'm going to try to show you guys all of the, you know, tricks that I like to do using tornado with this deck, which is a ton of fun. And you can get some really nice locks on tower using these tornado tricks. So I would 100% recommend giving it a try. Let's just let that giant go. Maybe I'll log to cycle anyways, but that's about it. And he will get one hit. But again, we're, we're in the damage lead here. I'm not too mad about it now. One of the biggest tricks or tips I guess I will give you guys with this deck is you need to play defense first always. It's not like you're ever going to out push them and you know it's a very defensive deck so you just play defense and then what you end up doing is getting a you know you can rocket cycle people down or getting chip damage. I, why did I play that ice spirit? I don't know. I don't know what's going on with me man. That was a dumb play. Let's go ahead and play our evil mortar here and then just wait and see what he does. Now, if you're going to go for a tornado play, oh my goodness, this guy is just the CEO of missing his pulls. I'm going to let that go uh, because I, I think it's going to be easier to defend if we just let that go. And then we can play the knight right there on the egg. And let's pop the little prince ability here. Almost had that phoenix come back. That would have been bad. Let's go ahead and log here to cycle. Nice evil bomber. And let's go ahead and play the Ice Spirit to help out with that. He used his arrows. I'm going to go ahead and play my Evil Skellies and let's see what he does. And then let's go for our Mortar again. He's going to go for the Little Prince. He's going to have to pop the ability. And by the time he does that, we will have a lock on Tower. Evil Skellies also got on the Tower. So that's going to be Towered down. And you know what? I think that's going to be game. It might just be worth cutting to the next match. Let's make sure we can play some solid defense here. But, you know, if it's looking like we're fine, I'm probably going to cut to the next one. He's going to go for the Evil Zap. Let's go ahead and play the Skellies here. Let's tornado. I meant to play my ice spirit, I'm going to be honest, but that's okay. We can just do this, and then we can just log and play our skeletons, and we can play the ice spirit to slow him down as well. And that is going to be a solid defense. We'll just play the mortar here. That's going to be a good game. There's no way he's breaking through, so I'm going to go ahead and skip to the next matchup. All right, you guys, next matchup, let's go ahead and play the mortar here and, you know, risk getting hurt. Why not? He's, what the... Okay, he's going for the balloon. I could go for the king tower activation using my tornado for the balloon, but... You know what? I'm going to mess that up, I bet. So we're just going to chill out for a little bit. And he went for the zap, so he will get some death damage, which is annoying. Let's go ahead and cycle our skeletons here. And then just wait. I might switch to Evo Knight, honestly. I think Evo Knight might be better because we're playing Dagger Duchess so much. But we'll see. Let's go ahead and play the Ice Spirit here. And then let's play another Mortar because we are quick and fast with our cycle. Uh, he's going to go ahead and play the Tesla. I guess we can just kind of let that go. We can cycle our log here for some chip damage. Let's get our little prince down. And then let's play the knight right here to tank for the Valkyrie. We didn't catch the E-Wiz in time, but that's okay. Let's just wait. Maybe play the Ice Spirit and then go for the Evil Mortar, actually. Because then if he Teslas, the Tesla will get frozen by the Ice Spirit. He's going to go for the arrows. Let's play our skeletons in front just to tank for a tiny bit. And then he's why would he zap? Uh, that's going to be a lock on tower. Let's get the knight in front in case he teslas. But we should be good here. We're going to get a ton of damage, I think. Especially because the dagger duchess is going to run out of ammo. So that e-wiz is going to get melted because of the ice spirit. And that's going to be tower down. And I think that might be, not game, but that's going to be some really good damage. Those goblins are just going to work. Um, and that's rocket log range. So technically we're, we're chilling here. Uh, to cycle, I'll probably just play my log feel like it's the safest place so let's go ahead and do that and then let's oh oh oh! i messed up okay let's go ahead and rock it here and then just wait we should be okay i don't think we're gonna take too much damage if he freezes i can tornado that actually you know what that worked out in the end i'm i'm not mad about that let's play the ice spirit to reset that tesla i guess it's not really gonna work in time but that's okay and then hmm we just have to be we just have to be ready for that like balloon push that he's gonna bring us. So 
Let's go ahead and play the rocket, or not the rocket, the mortar here. We have the skeletons coming both ways. He's going to play the P.E.K.K.A. I'm going to Little Prince in the back here. And then if he goes for a balloon on this side, I can just tornado rocket. And let's go ahead and play the Ice Spirit here. Why would he do that? I don't know. Let's just play our skeletons right here. And then we can log. And I could tornado rocket. Let's just wait, actually. Let's play the knight here. Let's tornado all of this back together. And we're chilling. Very easy defense. Let's go for the mortar again and get an ice spirit in front of it. And he's going to go for the Evo Tesla. But at that point, we have won. We can just rocket that tower. Let's give him a good game. Give him a good luck. And let's go right on into the next matchup. All right, you guys, next matchup, we are up against Clay. He's giving us a good luck. Let's give him a good luck back. Oh my goodness, this guy is so nice. I have, like, man, they say Chivalry is dead, but not Clay. Clay is a nice guy. Let's go ahead and play our little prince here, and then we can just pull with the skeletons. Looks like we're playing either Giant, Graveyard, or Beatdown. Either way, I hate these decks, so hopefully we don't choke. Let's just let that little prince go. He's going to go for the E-Drag. Now, if there's any matchup that you guys are going to see me miss a rocket, it's definitely going to be this one. Because when you're defending, it is so important that you get that tornado rocket value. Um, and I guarantee I'm going to mess it up. That E-Drag is not even going to go past the tower, so that's great. Uh, he's going to get some really great value out of that E-Drag. Let's go ahead and rocket here. Please tell me that hits the Night Witch. Oh my goodness, I was scared there. Um... Pretty solid defense, we're chilling. We'll let that bomber get a hit, I don't care. And let's just cycle our skeletons in the back here and then kind of wait and see what he's doing. Looks like it's gonna be either Golem or E-Golem. I feel like I always see E-Golem with Skeleton King, but the meta's changed a little bit. Like this this looks like the, the typical E-Golem deck. Let's go ahead and play our, see, but he's got pump. So it looks like we're playing regular Golem. Let's go for the Evil Mortar here. I'm not gonna Fireball or not Fireball, sorry, Rocket that pump quite yet. Let's go ahead and tornado the Skeleton King off of the Mortar, and then the Knight will defend. Are you kidding me? That's splashing. <laughs> All right, well, that's tough, but at least we get some really good damage out of everything there, and we can just kind of chill for a little bit now. Let's wait and see what he does. I'm going to split my Evil Skellies in the back here, and then let's go ahead and Ice Spirit here. He's going to go for the Golem, so I'm just going to play the Knight in front of those Evil Skellies because that's going to force him to have to defend it. And then, there, yeah, there's the Tornado. And the Ice Spirit should allow us to get some nice damage on that tower, actually. So let's go ahead. You know, we're chilling, and we can play... He used his Tornado, actually, so he can't even push. So let's play our Little Prince here. Let's wait until... All right, there they are. Let's go ahead and tor uh, Tornado everything. And then let's log. Nice. We're going to get all of those Skellies. Let's get the Knight in front over here. And then let's get... Ooh, Ice Spirit. We might have to tornado again. Let's see. Actually, we're okay. We're chilling. Let's go ahead and play the mortar right here. Let's play some skellies just right here to help defend that. Let's get the little prince on this side. He's going to go for the uh, bats and the night witch, but we might get one shot. No, it doesn't look like we will. Let's go ahead and play an ice spirit here and get an evil mortar down with that little prince. He's going to go for the skeleton king. The right play probably would have been playing his uh, golem to kite that if he was able to, but I don't think he had the elixir for it. We can just play the knight in front here, and then let's actually tornado that skeleton, or not skeleton, sorry, E-Drag back, and that way he doesn't chain onto the mortar, and we can get some nice mortar damage out of that, and we're in a pretty good position here. Um, I don't want to rocket cycle quite yet. Actually, you know what? I don't care. I'm so reckless. I don't think he's going to take our tower in time, so let's go ahead. Let's tornado all of this, and then is that going to be log territory? I don't think so. We can just play our evil skellies right here, and then hopefully that skeleton king doesn't clap us let's go ahead and rock it let's give him a good game let's give him a good luck it's gonna be close but we're okay and let's go on into the next one looks like we might be playing against lava hound or maybe graveyard that's kind of what i expect when i see tombstone he's gonna go for a really aggressive fireball and some bats looks like this might be i think there's a giant in this deck if i had to guess um if there was anything I had to guess, it would be a giant being in this deck. Just because. Let's go ahead and play our Ice Spirit here. Let's split our Skellies in the back. And then... Let's just wait and see how he counters that Knight. He's going to play a Wizard, so I'm going to go ahead and play my Little Prince in the back here. What What is going on? Okay. This is an interesting deck. Maybe like a one-trick type of deck? I'm not too sure. Um, all I know is it's weird, and I don't know how to feel about it. Let's play the Knight. And then he's going to go for a, a good fireball, I guess. Um, let's pop our little prince ability and let's play our Evo Skellies. Let's just see if he has another spell. I don't, I'm don't. i sure he does, but 
let's just wait and see what he does to this. The Evo Skellies are going to get some really good value already. And one gets on the tower, so that's going to be tower down, I think. I don't think that firecracker is... Okay, <laughs> I stand corrected, but we still do get so much damage that, you know, we're we're in a really good position already off of the start. Let's go ahead and play our Ice Spirit right here to get a King Tower activation. Make sure you're always doing that. Okay, I don't. I have no words for the fact that we just missed that. Now, I think we can chip that right side down. So I think I'm going to play my Evil Mortar on this side and then just kind of wait things out. He's going to go for a Mega Knight, of course. There's the one trick we were talking about. There always is. Um, you know, always expect the unexpected, especially when you're playing Grand Challenges and Mega Knight is an option. He's got the fireball there. Our, he's going to let our, our knight take the opposite lane, which is interesting. Let's go ahead and Ice Spirit here with all of this just to kind of be annoying. Ice Spirit is a really good way to turn any push that, you know, could be very easily countered into something that has to be countered. We're going to misplay our freaking mortar as well. Oh my goodness, what is going on with me right now? All right, well, let's go ahead and let's just rocket this wizard. He's going to go for the evil bats and we can just tornado. Let's do that before they get their HP and very easy defense he's got the evil firecracker there i'm gonna play the knight right on the evil firecracker to take care of her because we can use the little prince ability when we need to so let's go ahead and pop that right now and then let's play our skellies let's go ahead and play an ice spirit really good fireball by him let's go ahead and log to interrupt the hog for a tiny bit and that's going to be a pretty easy win let's give him a good game let's give him a good luck and let's go on into the next one all right you guys for this last matchup i wanted to do it using dagger duchess and evo knight just to give you guys a little bit of you know, action using that to show you guys that there are lots of different options. So we got the Evil Knight, we got the Dagger Duchess, let's go ahead and rock with it. He's got the Mortar, or uh, sorry, not the Mortar, the freaking Knight, I've got the Mortar. Let's go ahead and play our little Prince there. And, you know, pretty, pretty easy defense. Honestly, Dagger Duchess is so broken. I feel like when it first came out, everybody was like, it's terrible, myself included. I was like, ew, this, it sucks, like, get rid of it. Like, <laughs> And then, of course, it turns out to have like a freaking million percent win rate and usage rate let's go ahead and log this so that that goes down and he doesn't get too much value that'd be great if my mortar would shoot thank you very much and are we locked no we're not but we are now he's gonna poison pretty good poison there let's see if we can get a shot man oh my goodness it is just this is not going well guys but because he used his poison we can go ahead and little prince in the back and we can build a bit of a push for our evil mortar sometimes you have to take a little bit of damage to give a little so let's go ahead and play the knight here and then let's go for the evil mortar and we got a solid push there terrible tesla by him what why did my mortar do that what was that we are locked on tower now though um let's pop our little prince ability it's it's gonna get shredded by the tesla and everything but it's gonna keep everything alive a little bit longer and so you know we're gonna get a, a nice little win here honestly this is so easy we might have to do a second one we'll see he's gonna go for the poison um Really good damage though, I'm just going to cycle my log and then we can even cycle an ice spirit here just to get a little bit of chip damage. But he's so low at this point that we could definitely chip him down to get the win. Let's go ahead and little prince on the opposite side. Maybe he's given up, we'll see. Um, let's mortar here. Okay. Alright, I think he's given- what? Okay, we just got- we just got tricked. We just got absolutely freaking tricked there. Let's go ahead and log all of this and then... Um, Hmm, let's just wait. I don't think we're gonna really need to do much. Let's go ahead and play the knight here. Play an ice spirit. And then let's play some skeletons as well. And all of that should get taken care of. Let's get the little prince here. Let's log. And then let's get the knight right here. I can't believe he tricked us, man. That was absolutely disrespectful. Let's go ahead. We got the mortar down. Let's play an ice spirit in case he plays the Tesla. There it is. And then we can play these skeletons. And then we can play the evil knight in front. What? What is going on here? Why did that? Okay. Well then, let's go ahead and play the Evil Mortar here, because he's got to go quite aggressive. Let's wait a second, and then let's log. And then we can just play these skeletons right here. And let's play the Knight as well to keep that alive. That's going to be a good game. I'm going to do one more, because I am... I'm a gambler, and this was too easy for it to be my last match. Alright, you guys, last matchup for real. I'm a gambling addict at heart. It's hard to quit when you're up, you know? So let's go ahead and play our Little Prince here. He's going to... This guy's going aggressive. Let's just play our Knight and then kind of chill royal ghost is really annoying against cannoneer or not cannoneer sorry dagger duchess i'm gonna rock at this little prince just because um i don't like i wouldn't ever do that 90 percent of the time i just felt like we had 
a counter push going and he would have to defend it so we would be okay to do that but 90 percent of the time i would never do that unless it's like triple elixir let's just wait and he's gonna cycle his skeletons at the bridge let's go ahead and play a miner or, or an ice spirit for the miner and then let's just play our knight here for the ghost and that's going to be defended and then we can go ahead and play a mortar because he's kind of spending a lot of elixir let's get the skeletons in front in case he plays a building but we are okay there's the tesla and will the knight tank for us I guess it won't really make a difference, and that's okay. Let's go ahead and just log here to cycle and get rid of that little prince. And if he goes for like Evo Skellies or something crazy, then we have our um, tornado. I guess I should be going for a King Tower activation using my tornado here pretty soon. So we definitely will do that. Let's just wait. There's the uh, poison. So let's go ahead and play our mortar here. And then let's go ahead and play a Evo Knight. Ooh, that did not work out. Oh, he's cooked. He is in trouble now because we got the evil knight going. Those skeletons went down. He's going to have to log. Let's go ahead and play an ice spirit here. And then we're at our evil mortar. So depending, if he plays a Tesla at the bridge for this, then we can go ahead and evil mortar the opposite lane, which is nice. Um, hopefully our evil knight, if our evil knight can get enough damage on that little prince, nice. I'm happy. I'm happy with what we got there. Let's go ahead and log. And then I guess we're going to have to play our little prince right here. Uh, and then let's go ahead and mortar. Let's get our skeletons in front. And now we're playing the opposite lane, which is really nice. And we're going to be locked on tower because he really misplayed that. So that's good. Let's go ahead and play an ice spirit here. And then he's going to give us a really good log on all of that, which is nice. And again, we can use our tornado if we need to. Um, we do have to be careful though, because this is a this is a dangerous push against our little dagger duchess let's go ahead and play the knight here we don't even need to use our tornado which is really nice i'm gonna wait for that little prince to go down now we can mortar let's go ahead and play an ice spirit but at this point we can rocket cycle if we need to um we're gonna be locked on tower i'm just gonna hit that tower with a rocket because that's gonna be game we can go ahead and log as well and then we can just tornado whatever he plays so let's go ahead and play the evil knight here play our skeletons and then just kind of wait but that's going to be good game thank you so much for watching guys i really appreciate it i hope you guys have some luck using this deck either in ladder or a grand challenge and i will see you guys in the next one